Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTaker. In this one, I'm going to uh, test the black color crush issue in the Realme GT Neo 2 device after the recent Realme UI 3.0 trial version update. As you can see, just yesterday only I did receive the trial version, which is a Realme UI 3.0. This is not the stable version, only trial version. But in this one, I'm going to check the black color crush issue. Is it got fixed with this Realme UI 3.0 in this phone or not? And these are the exact comments I'm getting on this Realme UI 3.0, as you can see, friends, regarding the Realme GT Neo 2 black color issue got solved or not and if you're new to this kind of problem this problem this is not a big problem so to be frank it's not a huge problem i would say friends definitely so it's kind of little bit if you try to look into the problem only then you will be able to find that kind of issues otherwise you won't be able to notice so right now let's see i'll try to play the same video which i did play before to demonstrate the black color crush issue is it happening in this phone or not so make sure to watch till end of the video to get to know all the details you will be able to understand exactly let me to play the video so this exact video which I'm going to play friends right now in this kind of demonstration if there is any kind of room I think lighting and environment you won't be able to observe any kind of black color crush issue the main reason is because you won't be able to see it I need to close complete uh, turn, turn off all the lights so I can I'll be back after some time so this is the same video friends which I'm trying to play at this moment with complete darkness so there is no light in the room at all and I'm trying to play with the full brightness okay full brightness and right now you'll be able to see exactly what is happening as you can see friends the crush issue which is going on at this moment the sideways you will be able to see from somewhere the light is coming let me turn on the other light there's no lights in the room right. as you can see clearly there is this kind of black crush issue i need to slow it down let me know to keep in the slow motion i mean to bring a slow slow speed yes so this should be kind of good to go starting from here yes after this scene, you will be able to see exactly spot on with the black like crush issue. Try to observe carefully. With the full brightness, friends, I am trying to use, not with the off brightness. Now, complete dark, right? Now, you will be able to see one, two, three. Yes, this is what call as you can see exactly. So, more, I think few of the AMOLED panels, they will be having this kind of uh, black like crush issue, friends, anyway. So still that kind of problem is existing, but this problem you will be able to find out only if you try to look into the problem. Otherwise, you won't be able to notice much of the black color crush issue. Only when if there is any kind of black color, this looks little you can kind of fade it out sometimes. Only in the black color section in this kind of department, as you can see in this area, exactly. Yes. So still the black color crush issue got uh, not fixed and I'm trying to mention again and again this is not a big problem this kind of little bit kind of small problem only but not a big problem as you can see on the background how it's getting crushed on the back as you can see exactly what's going on in this trailer so this is what called the black color crush issue overall in the realme gt neo 2 so still it did not get fixed friends after the realme ui 3.0 update you can see how what is happening so that's it friends, thank you for watching, stay tuned for more updates and in case if you're having any other queries let me know in the comments below regarding the Realme GT Neo 2. If you have any other doubts on this particular phone definitely I might be able to help you out with your device so don't forget to let me know in the comments below what are your thoughts and meanwhile signing off friends until then stay tuned for more updates and bye.